Some new faces will be seen in South Carolina now that the midterm elections have wrapped up. South Carolina Bureau Chief Shakira Speaks tracked down some of last night's biggest winners to talk about their plan for the next term. The cheers are over and the signs are coming out of the ground as South Carolina politicians gear up for the next term. District 6 York County Councilman Brandon Guffey now represents State House District 48 after defeating his Democratic opponent, Andrew Russell, by nearly 6,000 votes. He lost his son to suicide after online extortion, and the first thing on his agenda for the folks of District 48 and the state is enhancing mental health services. Uh, South Carolina is one of the few states that don't protect teens online, um, and that's something that's got to change. Um, you know, I sit here and talk about being against government overreach, but we need to have government protect our children. Guffey says he ran on policy and not just party. He's all about protecting the people. Meanwhile, William Bump Roddy was reelected to his seat that he's held for 12 years. He says he's going to continue to work for the people of District 4. Continue to recruit good jobs, good well-paying jobs, so the citizens of Rock Hill and York County can continue to live here. Congressman Ralph Norman is entering another term overseeing District 5. He wants people to continue to come to the Palmetto State for a better life. You've got to keep the taxes low, regulations low, and make it business friendly. I'm a business person, and I look forward to doing that. Reporting in York County, Shakira Speaks, Queen City News.